None of this progress will happen without capital. Lots of capital. The, enti the entire financial community needs to play a much bigger role. And according to the IEA, the world invested 1.4 trillion US dollars in the energy transition in 2022. We need over three times that amount. Capital must come from all sources, governments, the private sector, institutional investors, private equity, industry, and international financial institutions. And when it comes to financing the energy transition, we must ensure that no one is left behind. Only 15% of clean tech investments reached developing economies in the global south. And that is where 80% of the population live. That is why we need to fundamentally reform the IFIs and the MDBs to unlock concessional finance, lower risk, and attract greater private investment. I hope that we can make real traction on this front at the upcoming IMF World Bank Spring Meetings next month.